Hi, parents. This is Nadine Gilkison. I'm the District Technology Integration Specialist. I wanted to go ahead and cover a few things about e-learning um, for this coming week, which is going to be April 13th through the 17th. One of the things that I had gotten feedback on was that parents were confused because we still had the words home link in the slides and we actually stopped adding the home link uh, literally because we were trying to make it easier for you guys at home. Uh, so I apologize, we were trying so hard to make sure that we catch every little item, but that was one that we forgot to take off. I have taken it off uh, for this week. It really is simply the math boxes and then just doing the practice uh, with the videos with, from those student math journal pages. Uh, so that was really the big item. Um, I know some people still had some questions about the related arts. I put any day, so literally any day of the week, your child can work on the related arts slides. And with all of these, the best I want to, I want to make sure that I convey this message, do the best that you can. We all know that in this crisis, in this situation, that we're all trying to um, give your child the best semblance of instruction during this time. But if there's some direction that's on there that you're not able to do at home, we don't want you to stress about it. For instance, this week in the reading, it's about cause and effect. We're asking you to watch a video and then the anchor chart is about cause and effect. And then if possible, again, if possible, have your child fill out the anchor chart that goes with it um, right next to it. There's a graphic organizer. If your child can't complete that, that is totally fine. Um, and the upper grades, your child should be able to, unless you guys are having some difficulty with devices at home. The younger grades, when you guys get to that, um, just have a conversation with your child. Uh, watch the video about the story have some pauses during the video or even after the story, have some discussion about some of the important events that happened and what caused those events. Basically, if you're just having that dialogue with your child, then um, that's perfectly fine with us, okay? Um, the only other thing that I can think of, some people had questions, um, again, about being able to access the file. Don't forget that if you're using a smartphone, or um, you need access to the paper pencil, that's why we've added that web page link. I'm trying to monitor like the Facebook um, chats and so on. I don't want anybody to feel like that they're overwhelmed. If anyone's having any problems at all um, and you reach out on Facebook, I know that our principals are trying to help you out. Teachers are trying to help you out. And if needed, if someone needs to reach out to me, uh, Nadine Gilkison, you can. And we just want to make sure that your child is able to get what they need.